I'm making sure I don't miss anything on this island. Another body. What do you have? Oh, that's that's my 1,000 crowns. That was the captain. I got my money back. You need not do this, child. I know. But I want to. This madness. Such a young lass. Erna should be the one going. They shared a bed long Silence. Over. It is her decision. You look beautiful. Thank you. Nice to see you again. The eulogy. King Bran of Clan Twirsech has embarked on his final voyage. At its end, our glorious ancestors await him. Together they will hunt and raid. They will sit round the fire and praise the deeds of ages past. For now, he lives in our hearts. One day, we too shall stand at his side and face the sea together. That will be a good day. Uh-oh, time to start working on getting that splash going. You smell wonderful. Geralt, we're at a funeral. You smell wonderful at this funeral. Skellige is its clans. In times of war, tradition holds the clans unite under the leadership of their king. We bid Bran farewell. Time to pick his successor who will lead us against the Black Ones. The gates of Caer Troll stand open to all who held Bran of Clan Twirsach, dear. Mead and meat will be plentiful. During the wake, those who believe themselves worthy of the crown will step forth. It's gonna take a lot of effort, a lot of compliments. I gotta keep this up. I haven't seen each other in two years. I want a solitary cottage by the sea. I want to lock myself inside with you. Stay there for a week. What would we do there for a week? Got so many ideas. The one with the rope you use for trophies. That one seems interesting. Well, look what we have here. Reading my mind again? Mm. What's more, I like what I see.
Did you learn anything in Velen? Velen. Awful place. Somehow Ciri wound up at the castle of the local ruler, a baron, self-proclaimed. This was after she was injured. Injured? Was it serious? Don't think so. Must have recovered because this baron sent her on to Novigrad. Think she was looking for you at the time. These witches Ciri came across, she was lucky to escape them. Witches? Creatures more like. Can't say exactly what they are, but they're dangerous. Very. Also ran into an old friend of ours in Velen. Kira. What on earth is Kira Metz doing in that wasteland? Hiding from witch hunters. Listen, she told me an elven mage had been there looking for Ciri. Good. You'll need to tell me more when we have some time. Ciri found Dandelion in Novigrad. They met up. Dandelion got them in trouble. Ciri made an enemy of Horson Jr., one of the city's crime bosses. So Dandelion knows what happened to Ciri? Yeah. Gotta find him. How about you? What have you learned? Something strange happened on Art Skellig a time ago. A disaster brought about by a burst of magic. Extraordinary, really. Natural anomaly. Never seen anything like it. My intuition tells me Ciri was its cause. As much as I respect your intuition, Yen, we need something specific. Evidence. I'd know for certain if I was able to inspect the disaster zone. Unfortunately, Ermion and his druids aren't letting anyone near. Ermion's head of the Skellige Circle? Haven't seen him since... Um... Since Ciri was a little girl. I doubt he'll do you any favors, not even for old time's sake. So why won't Ermion let you inspect the area of the anomaly? Call it a difference of opinion. A large, loud difference. Look, it's Krach. Wait, Wolf! Greetings, Krach. I shall see you at the wake, and I'll not accept any excuses. I have an important matter to discuss with you. Guess our solitary hut will have to wait. Crack on crate someone we want on our side. I shall wear black and white for the feast. I count on you to don something complimentary. Something that doesn't reek of a thousand hunts. Yen, you know I can't stand new doublets. Just too tight till you break them in. And just like Crack, I'll not accept any excuses. We're not here to enjoy ourselves. We've matters to resolve and should dress appropriately. I've rented a room at the inn. Took the liberty of laying out some clothes for you there. You ought to go. Choose something. In the meantime, I have something to attend to. We'll meet at the entrance to the feast hall. Why not put on the outfit she wants? I want everything to be in my favor. I don't want any part of my game to be slacking. This has got to be Yen's room. She always did like space and luxury. Who doesn't like space and luxury? Well, that's interesting. Glamour. Scent of lilac and gooseberries, even with the lid on. Taste hasn't changed. Is that what I think it is? Hmm. The stuffed unicorn. She fixed it. That's good news. That means she's been thinking about me. No idea how she managed to bring so much clothing. Must have hired out a galleon. As usual, black and white. That's what women do. They have this skill for bringing tons of clothes with them. And they pack it so nicely. Her megascope? Guess she never goes anywhere without it. As Philippa Eilhart said, megascopes and toothbrushes. Deeply personal possessions. Tessia de Vries, the poison source. Still turns to it for inspiration. Let's read that and you can pause if you want to read the full thing. I guess the clothes are in the chest. You know she loves, she's been fantasizing about these clothes, this attire. We gotta put these on. When I, when she sees me, she's gotta tremble. <laughs> 
She's got to be shaking like the leaves on a tree on a windy day. We got to make her tremble. Take off those gloves. That makes me look smoother, right? Right. Just not something I'd ever wear. But what don't we do for her? Hmm. Who exactly is she to me? And there she is. Talking to somebody else and I'm looking good. I'm looking too smooth. Bran was a great ruler. He needs a worthy successor. You speak as though you have someone in mind. Skellige's trouble is very much derived from it not being a hereditary monarchy. Any upstart can be king and destroy his predecessor's legacy. The King of the Isles is a more symbolic position. That should change as well. A strong leader who wields true power. That is what the times require. Introduce me. This is my friend Geralt, and this is Berna, widow of the dear departed Bran. The Queen Mother. It's a pleasure to meet you, Geralt. You must forgive me, but on a day like today, I'm afraid I cannot indulge in my poncho for long conversations. Lovely outfit. You look dashing. Thank you. You're dazzling. You know, I really missed your candidness. I'm glad we're here together. <sighs> Don't like funerals. Don't like feasts. I know. You also dislike underdone meat and being teleported. But sometimes we must overcome our disgusts and prevail. We should mingle before they all get drunk. There'll be no talking to anyone then. Good thinking. I don't know what Krach wants, but when we meet with him, we should have clear minds. I'm not gonna drink. Why dull my senses when I'm in such pleasant company? Do you plan to compliment me all evening? I plan to tell you what I think. Oh, whoa, it's working. Ha <laughs> ha! Look at that face, look at that body moving. <laughs> The face, the reaction that she made, her expression. She's falling for you, boy. She's trembling, all right. Ha <laughs> ha! Geralt, there's something I've been meaning to ask you. Hmm? Your beard. Why did you decide to grow it out? Don't really know. Hmm. Must say it suits you. Oh my goodness, we hit the jackpot. We're doing everything right. We're, we're just, we're beasting and feasting. Lady Yennefer, sir. Greetings, Arnvald. My companion is Geralt of Rivia. I am honored. We wanted to talk to Croc on Crate. The Jarl will join us shortly. He's assigned you a place of honor at the table just beside his daughter, Ceres. Follow me, please. They've seated us here. I asked them to. I wanted to meet the notorious Witcher, Geralt. We've met. Don't remember? That was ages ago. Yalmer and I were children when you last visited Orda. But you should meet your face mates. Allow me the dubious honor. That's Halbjorn, son of Holger Blackhand. Blue boy Lucas, Madman Lucas' firstborn. And choking down a stockfish over there is Otric on Hindar. They set us with the sons of Jarls, exclusively. Ceres on Crate is the daughter of a Jarl, Geralt. Jarl's daughters are in no way inferior to their sons. Do you know, every last one of them dreams of being Bran's successor? Look at him. Likely lot. Ceres is jealous, for the one among us who performs the greatest feat will be crowned king. <laughs> we all know the feats are a sideshow. Our fathers will choose who will wear the crown. What do you think they spoke to Crack about? You talk like that because you're short of strength and skill. Remember when Hjalmar challenged us all to a race up the mount? You didn't stand with us then. As he buried his axe in that stump at the top to mark his victory, you were warming your chicken bones by the fire. Had my reasons for not participating, but I would have won then, as I'd win now. Hmm, now that you mention him, just noticed Hjalmar's not here. My brother walks his own paths. But about the race, why don't we repeat it? 
I'm willing to challenge any of you, Witcher included. If I beat him to the top, venture to say that'll be a feat, eh? So you're in. If the Witcher's in. Geralt? I ain't got time for that. I'm trying to make it splash, lady. Honored to be asked, but maybe some other time. Yeah, shame. Enough of the Nather and let's drink. I don't want to make a new move when the big moment comes. Gotta be sober. Can't today, for good reason, believe me. But if not today, then when? You've been great company. Sadly, it's time we moved on. Really? Indeed. We must talk, but not here. You shall learn all beyond that door. <laughs> Come on now, you know we're not going to be getting it popping here. What's going on here, baby? What are we doing here? What do you want? Allow me to introduce Geralt of Rivia, a witcher. Geralt, Jarl Donar and Hinder, and Jarl Madman Lugos. Calling Lugos a madman's an insult to madmen? He's a common goat fucker. Call me a goat fucker one more time, and I'll chop off your head, stick it on a pike, and piss down your neck hole. Enough! Time to settle this. Here and now. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Giving me a true freight right now. Shot my best trousers. Put that away before you cut yourself, you cunt. Thought Skelligers called a truce for feasts. I know the hallowed customs. But Lugos ought to know that I'll not let him raid my Hindus Fial bear. You don't scare anyone, Donor. I'll be boy soon to plow your priestesses, drink from your tankard, and shit on your table. Be sure to leave a candle lit for me. Emperor would be very pleased to hear you quarrel. His Imperial Majesty is more than welcome to visit. Let him sail over here. We ain't afraid of the Black Ones. Raiding coastal villages is one thing. Total war with the Empire is another. Awfully mouty, this one. Go stir your cauldron and pierce some boils, witch. Don't talk when you haven't got a fucking clue. Here's my chance to stand up. Know what, Lugos? Just realized I don't give a damn about your hallowed rules of hospitality. Finally, some toy first. And here I was ready to puke from all the boredom. Come on, freak. Show us what you're made of. Move the benches. There's to be some gob slapping. Oh wow, this guy's a level 30. I'm a level 18. Look at his 30 cheese. Take that. Oh, oh. He's got some kind of bar under him. It's, what is that? Is that his stamina? Is that his defense? We got to get rid of that defense so I can take out that red. Take out that. Wow, his, his, it won't go down. This is unbelievable. I'm so close. Okay, let's go fast attacks. Fast attacks. Oh, oh, the fast attacks. I'm letting it fly. The strong attacks he blocks, but the fast attacks, he has no answer. Oh, oh, he hasn't thrown a punch. What kind of boxing match is this? Down goes, Frazier. <sighs> Had enough. Ah, oh, oh, you got me good. That were quite a wallop. Still seeing spots, room, rocking like a leaky tub in a hurricane. We'll call it even then, as soon as you apologize to the lady. Don't hold it against me, my lady. It's my deep conviction. Sorceresses are needed. Deeply so. No offense taken. Forget about it. That, my like. And the knocking. It's what men do. Give me your paw, Witcher. Let me squeeze. It's a worthy one. Witcher, have a drink with me. Proof there's no hard feelings. And visit me at times, I insist. Yaren's been jabbering about bringing in a Witcher for that haunted lighthouse. Do me a favor, meet him for an ale in the tavern near Aaron Bjorn. Then you but a short jaunt to find me, so as we can knock back something stronger. Here's to our next. No hard feelings, why not? Sure. I'll knock one back with you, Lugos. Drink like you fight, and we're in for a good time. Tabran! Yennefer and I'd be honored. Here's to your health. Forgive us, 
We should mingle, talk to some of the other guests. Make it splash and shot clock cheese cases are now available for the iPhone 5, the iPhone 5S, and the iPhone 6. You can get these on my website at shop.chrismove.com. It's going down to the ground. I don't care. Oh, take that. Oh, you do not want it with me. I got to get it out of the sky. Maybe I should get off of this ship because if it's going to. Oh, no, it's floating. I got him. I got him. Oh, I got him. He's trapped. He's trapped. One more hit. Ooh. 